All right, what we're looking at here is our water vapor imagery. I just wanted to show you all the dry air that we have in place. That's the orange that's being depicted here on our satellite. So we have this very dry air in place. We're in great shape. Temperature is still very mild at this hour in the upper 60s and low 70s right now. During the overnight, temperatures only fall into the mid 60s. So it'll be another comfortable start tomorrow morning. Not as cool as this morning, but it will be Nice as the dew points start to get a little stickier though tomorrow. They're going to be climbing into the upper 60s and low 70s. So in combination with the warm air, it's going to feel like the low to possibly mid, mid 90s tomorrow afternoon. So it is going to be a hot 4th of July. And looking at the Indianapolis climatology for Independence Day, the average high is 85. The record high, 103 degrees set back in 1911. The record low, 48. Not going to come close to that. And then the coolest maximum was 70 degrees back in 2009. The warmest minimum, 78 degrees, also in 1911, which was also the record high. So that makes sense. We are not tracking that kind of heat, but it is going to be hot. Temperatures climb to 89 degrees, and with the high humidity, it will feel like the low to mid-90s. Now, tomorrow night for the fireworks, we're going to have mostly clear skies to clear skies. Perfect night for fireworks. Temperatures at 10 p.m., 77 degrees in Indianapolis, where those fireworks will be shooting off. So it's going to be a terrific evening for fireworks. Monday still part of our holiday. 90 degrees will be the high on Monday. We're going to be hot and humid on Tuesday as well. Highs in the low 90s before some changes start to push in. By the middle of the week, we are tracking some rain and some thunderstorms along with a stalled out boundary that will move in. Upper 80s will be the high on Wednesday, then cooler for Thursday as the cold front sweeps through. High of 81, mainly dry right now for Friday. May have to change that, but looking drastically cooler next Saturday with highs in the mid 70s, breezy and stormy. We'll be right back.